working out with these ball hog gloves is changing everything, the whole dynamic of the workout. It takes away your grip. So the ball slips out of your hands. You really gotta be able to control the ball. For quality basketball training products, go ahead and log on to ballhoggloves.com. God first, work until. Bear in drop coverage. Here's Bullock into the paint. 13 to shoot and Jalen Brunson with it. He's isolated working on O'Neal who is 6'4". In he comes. High bank up and in. Reset of the shot clock. Gobert has it jammed away by Brunson. Recovered by Dinwiddie. Excellent hands right there by Rick Brunson on the weak side. And Finney Smith with the three ball. And they believe that helps them set up their defense. They are not looking to push the tempo on Utah. Long minutes to both Brunson and Dinwiddie was a concern as Brunson outside. It's this the playoffs. Every shot like that has to be contested. You got to get a hand up. Don't tell me you want to win. Show me you want to win. Brunson off the high screen. Let's it go. Mitchell the loss. Go Bears. And they got to get it. Angles it up. Run out of room. Dallas the other way. Brunson on the run. Why not? Hello. 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 Here's Conley. He draws a crowd off the Bogdanovich. He's forced to spin. He juggles the ball. Let's grab by Brunson. We got a man the with up. Benny Smith ahead. Eight to shoot. Late on the clock. Brunson goes to work. Gets a hit. White side switches. Now O'Neal's back on him. He'll raise. And score! Behind the play, holding his eye. House into the lane. is hand out to Hassan Whiteside. Not even close. Four turnovers. Yeah, Dinwiddie, Dinwiddie might have got poked in the eye. He's still doing something funny with his eye right there. But... And the Mavericks have found something they like in this pick and roll. They're going to keep Whiteside in it and see if Brunson can continue to attack it and get bucket. And the answer to that question is yes. And that made three you saw a moment ago. His fourth already in less than a game and a half into the series could be huge. He was just a 56 since March 1st. That was a heat check right there. When you're feeling good and you got it rolling, sometimes you got to just test it a little bit just to see how hot you are. Dinwiddie gets two feet in the paint and scores on an easy lefty. Off the back iron in traffic. He's hit in the mouth. He's down on the opposite end of the floor. Dallas plays five on four. Dinwiddie lines up a three. And he scores. 14 points, five of seven from the field in the first half. Brunson comes off the screen. O'Neal fights over the top of the pick. Brunson got in deep with a flip. O'Neal pumps, drives. Finney Smith from behind, spikes it off the window. Brunson the other way. He'll go right up, gets up with a reverse. Third foul on Clarkson. Brunson from three. First team to really dig down and play some tough defense, that might be the team that gives himself a best chance to win. Utah, 8 of 18 from three. Brunson sends in another one. A Hello. sizzling triple. 13 of 30. And Reggie Bullock as well. He is a pretty good defender, but he can't stick with Mitchell. The last word in the corner is that of Maxi Kleba from Wurzburg, Germany, hometown of the great Dirk Nowitzki. Guy Davis, as he knocks down that, that tight two right there, but that's by design. Gives the kids to this Mavericks defense. They want to run Utah off the three-point line as Jalen Brunson continues to go to work and have himself a ball game. That's what you have to do in that situation. If you're giving up size, you have to go out there and come out there with the right type of energy. Oh. But speaking of the right type of energy, Jalen Brunson right down the lane for the floater. Brunson ahead of steam. He barrels in deep and scores! Wow. Brunson switches right to left. Steps back, finds Kleba, another three. Maxi Kleba getting it done, his seventh triple of the night. Bullock straightens up, house with a screen, springing. Brunson into the paint, outside, there he is. Dorian Finney-Smith.